repeat and reset. So what I'm doing now is, this is the pipe that lets all the water flow out. I'm just basically making the holes bigger because I put a new pump on now, which is a thousand pressure. The last one was 500, this is double the size. So I'm now making the holes bigger. I've just fitted the new pump, it's one of these ones. It's an innovator pump and it's a thousand. And like, yeah, because my tank is so, so big, I had to put a pom pump on it. No fish tank pump is big enough for this. So this is how I'll do it. I'm now making the holes bigger on here. And now I'm gonna put this pump back on, push it under here, like that. Under like that. Then a bit of rope to hold it in place. Like that. Then plug it into here. Actually, I want to catch the first load out. It could be uh, horrible. My assistant, Gemma, can you plug this plug in when I say? Down here. This plug here, can you plug it in for me please? That plug there. Thank you. Let's go. Lovely. Is there any water coming out of there? Keep an eye on it because your hands are dry. Just see if anything's leaking anywhere. That is a much more powerful pump. There you go. We just need to keep an eye now on that. Is, is that all staying dry there? I've just connected the new pump, and as you can see, coming out. See that? Right, then it needs to all be tripped up. Okay, that is how you fit a new pump. But now I've got to take it all apart because there's a slight leak on the pump. Obviously, some uh, washer is not connected. I will fix it. Shine on. This is how to fit a new pump professionally and properly. Have a great day, everybody. Love your fish. Your fish will love you.